Welcome to this demo of Core Capture with Continuous Machine Learning. Why is Continuous Machine Learning important? It's important because documents change. They change all the time. You don't realize it because it happens so slowly. One document from one vendor doesn't change very often, but invoices are a good example. On average, the invoice for a single vendor changes format or field content only about once per year. But when you multiply this by 10,000 vendors, then on any average day, you'll see roughly 30 new invoice formats. This is why template-based systems required so much maintenance and why companies switched to rules engines and neural network technologies. These better tolerate small format changes, but are still prone to accuracy degradation as the formats of the documents they get in production become more and more different than the formats of the documents the models were trained on. This is why neural nets and rules engines need periodic retraining, which involves collecting a new representative sample set, scrubbing the data set for outliers, labeling fields, retraining, retesting, and finally putting the new model into production, which starts the cycle all over again. We believe there is a better way, and that's why we invented our patented continuous machine learning technology. Now let's see how this works. From our first example, the format of the medical document changes. Tess has processed one of the new forms using her production system like she does every day. Now let's take a look at the changed form. The personal information at the top has been reformatted and the gender field has been split into two fields, gender identity and gender assigned at birth. The old template-based systems would return blank for gender, but the newer technologies will either return blank or more likely will take their best guess at what is wanted and be wrong 50% of the time. Here you can see that Core Capture's best guess is wrong. It used gender assigned at birth. When Innovate really wants to capture gender identity. Neural net or rules technologies would require retraining and would take time while Tessa is seeing these new documents coming in every day. We're going to retrain our production model in real time without requiring IT or a data scientist. Our normal production operator as part of their daily job simply clicks on the correct field to, to use. Tessa clicks Next and then Submit. And in the background, we're learning the change. Now the next document comes in. Let's go ahead and select that and run it through classification and data extraction. On that last document, we told our machine learning engine that the model for extracting gender was wrong. We don't want gender assigned at birth. We wanted gender identity. So on this document, the model didn't return a value. It was uncertain which field to use. Tessa clicks on gender identity again to reinforce the model to use. She then goes up and clicks next and submit to complete the training. Now the machine learning engine has enough information to confidently extract the correct value. A little later in the same day, a third document comes in. We classify it and extract the metadata. And now the extracted data is correct. It now recognizes the gender identity field, and we didn't have to involve IT, collect new document examples, perform data labeling, or retrain a neural net. Instead of taking days or weeks, it's done in a matter of minutes by operators who are just doing their normal daily work.